You picked a fine time to leave me, Lucille. With four hungry children and a clock in the field. I've had some bad times, lived through some sad times. But this time you're hurting more heal. You picked a fine time to leave me, Lucille. Ooh, Cancer, what's going on? Hi, Cancer, this is Molly. I'm a Claire Audience Intuitive Empath. Um, I got Kenny Rogers and Seal in my head. Uh, the lyrics are, you picked a fine time to leave me, Lucille, with four hungry children in a crop in the field. I've had some bad times, lived through some sad times. But this time you're hurting won't heal. You picked a fine time to leave me, Lucia. All right, let's see what we got going on for Cancer. It's cancer, Cancer, Cancer. Cancer, I am using the Star MS Gallery Grand Deck. We'll just see what comes out. Cancer, 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 Cancer. I'm just gonna shuffle the cards. <laughs> Did you see that flip? <laughs> cancer, 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 cancer. Cancer, 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 cancer. Oh, there's a big story. Okay. Cancer, here we go. You picked a fine time to leave me, Lucio. Okay, so um, you picked a fine, you picked a fine time to leave me, Lucio. Okay, yes. Um, the message is, Cancer, it is time to release something. Yes, there's something that. Um, we have the Divine Masculine and the Divine Feminine showing up over this spread. And it's time to release something. The Light Keeper is here. The Light Keeper is the Peacekeeper of the deck. And he is shining his light on it is time to release something. And uh, you may be thinking of breaking up with someone. You may have broken up with someone. You may have um, quit a job. You may have just released something. Are you thinking about it? Um, next, we have the author showing up and Rebirth. And the author is very careful communication. The author is not a what's up text. The author is, just imagine if you had to um, write whatever this communication is out on this old fashioned typewriter. You would think really hard because there's no backspace delete. This is only going forward. So, that has something to do with this, too. There is no backspace delete. There is only going forward. Because when you use a typewriter, you have, if, you, if there's a mistake, there's crusty whiteout all over the paper. And, you know, from afar it might look okay, but from up close, you see that crusty whiteout all over the place. Then we have a rebirth showing up. Look at this. Look at this beautiful card. I, this is one of my favorite cards. This chicken is bursting out of the egg. This chicken has so much potential, so much uh, abilities, uh, zest, joy, everything just shooting out of this egg with it. It is a re rebirth. It is um, finding that spark in life. 
So you may be talking with someone or this may be a message to send a message <laughs> about some sort of rebirth or something along that line. Uh, this person may be an opposite person of what you're, you are, what you're used to. Um, you know, we have these two cats getting to know each other. They're walking down the street together. And look at this white cat. She's put a pretty bow on her neck because she wants to look cute for the black cat. And the black cat's like, hey, girl. And look at those tails. Yes, opposites do attract. You realize that. And now you're just taking some time to think about it. You're resting. You're just really um, contemplating sort of uh, your future. Um, kind of um, new opportunities. Because... This is a divine love. This is something sent to you by the universe. You do feel that pull. You feel um, a connection that's deeper than just, you know, hanging out or meeting somebody on Tinder. Or, no offense if you met your <laughs> true love on Tinder. You know what I'm getting at. You know, this is something deep. This is something straight up brought by the universe it has a magical a magical touch to it and you're super curious about it you're like what the hell oh my god let me take a look uh there is some fear there's been some fear in your past there's been some you know shadiness you've had to deal with in the past but you're moving on from it you know you're moving on Here's another cosmic card. This is brought on by the universe. The cosmic elephant. This is a big change that is thrown in your life and brought on by the universe to shake things up for you. And the reason it happened is to bring you peace. All right, bottom of the deck, Cancer. You may have to use some strategy in this. There is some... Um, some strategy needed. Uh, this is somebody who vibes on the same level. This is somebody who uh, understands. Uh, you may have found somebody who understands and thinks the same way you do. A very intelligent person. Something that may take some time. Oh, there it is. There's the Divine Feminine. Okay, so you may have... Um, uh, ran into somebody who is um, an empress type person, somebody who um, just emanates this feathery feminine energy out of them. And it's your reward, your re reward from the universe. And um, so I, it looks like there might be something that you have to leave behind or release. And the message is, it's time. The peacekeeper is shining its light on, on that release. And then, you know, down here we also have peace. So the, the universe is trying to bestow peace upon you, Cancer. With some sort of message or something um, that has sparked a rebirth. This person may be um, somewhat of an opposite person from you, something like that. It's time to take a rest. It's time to um, just really look at the situation, evaluate what this uh, is all about. Just uh, make a, uh, you may be thinking about your future. You may be thinking about, um, Just a lot about um, the situation because you do realize that this is some sort of a divine thing. It sparked your curiosity. It has shaken your life up in a crazy way out of nowhere. And you are understanding this is come in to help bring you peace. 
you are going to need to do some sort of strategy, some sort of um, something with this feminine. Uh, this is a very wise person, maybe a magical person, something along that line, somebody with some sort of gifts, something like that. And this person is your reward from the universe. So this person in your life um, is a reward given to you from the universe. All right, so let's get one final message for Cancer from the Star MS. Messages from your soul tribe around the world. <clears throat> Cancer, what a cool read. All right, let's see, let's see. All right, what's the final message for Cancer? Cancer, Cancer, oh, there it is. You are allowed to take up space. You sure are, Cancer. Woo-woo! All right, take up a whole bunch of space today, Cancer, because you're awesome. All right, take it easy, Cancer. If you like how I read, hit like and subscribe. Peace out. Love ya.